Hi, Ron and Marty, Steph, Spencer, Eric, and the entire team at the Cordes Foundation. I'm Sam Vagar with the Millennium Campus Network. And I have a simple question. How can I help you? Now, I don't have the whole answer to that question. I'm hoping it's a journey we can take together to solve. And the bottom line is this. I'm filming this in our home tonight, in the house I was raised in, because just as you're a family foundation, for me, my family is my foundation. They instill the values in me that make me the man that I am today. And I had some tough times in high school. I was somewhat isolated. I used to eat alone at the lunch table. It was a really tough experience. It's not something I share with too many people, but um, I share that because activism was where I found my voice. When I learned about extreme poverty and realized I could be part of the solution, that made me a student leader. And I realized that even as a student, my voice mattered. And now at 27 years old, I head the Millennium Campus Network to make sure that students across the United States know that their voices matter, that they can partner with schools and health clinics and clean water projects around the world. And they do that through student organizations that we invest in every single day. Now once a year we have the Millennium Campus Conference. It is becoming a central hub, an organizing hub, a moment and part of a movement for students and higher education leaders across the country. A thousand Millennium delegates from 200 campuses, higher education leaders, media, government, private sector leaders, and yes, we would love the Cordes Foundation to be a national co-chair of the event this year. I wanna show you one item from a past Millennium Campus Conference. This is a map of the world. Students wrote down their passions, their motivations in global development. Some focus on climate change, ending modern day slavery, a focus on uh, maternal mortality. And here's one of my favorites. It says, I want to maintain our most precious ecosystems. It's from a president, Darren Collins. You may know him. Great guy. Glad he came to the event. The bottom line is this. American businessman Peter Drucker said, the best way to predict the future is to create it. And I'm hoping that we can create it together and empower this next generation of global development leaders. Thank you so much.